I started the day at 7 a.m. That's what time my alarm was set for, but obviously I couldn't actually feel myself waking up, but this was pretty much as close as it gets. So when my alarm goes off, I kind of just lay there and really think about if it's necessary to get up, if working out is even worth it, if I should just stay in bed all day, and I pretty much do that for a solid like five minutes. <laughs> so then I actually decide to get out of my bed and start the day so I get up and I kind of just stretch and kind of try and wake myself up because I'm pretty tired then I go into my bathroom and I like to splash my face with cold water and brush my teeth like right when I wake up so then when I'm done with that I come out and I grab the outfit that I set out the night before on my dresser and I go into my bathroom to change into that Then I open my blinds because that just can really make the room seem so much brighter and even though it was a pretty gloomy day outside that day. Then I just make my bed and I don't do this every single morning but I really try to as much as I can. And by the way, these are not my sheets. I know they're pink. I don't really like pink. Literally, as I'm wearing a pink shirt, that's the second time I've said that in one of my videos. But um, yeah, my sheets are actually gray but me and my sister accidentally switched ours. But yeah, this is just me making my bed. So when I'm done with that, I just put my hair up into a ponytail. And yeah, this is just me putting it up into a ponytail. And I actually filmed like my shirt, but I have no idea where it went. Like the video just kind of disappeared. So my shirt is from Target, in case you were wondering. And then these workout leggings are from Walmart. So then I grabbed my water bottle and headed downstairs. So right when I go downstairs, I say hi to my dogs, who I love very much. Um, I have a black lab and a hound rescue. Then I made my breakfast, so I started by just cutting up some bananas, and I made the oatmeal that I make in pretty much every video where I showed what I eat, and then I just added some honey and some of the agave that I showed in an earlier clip, and I just drizzled the honey on top of the bananas. Then I filled up my water bottle. And then I go upstairs and brush my teeth after breakfast, and I'm brushing my teeth really, really slow because I filmed this on a Saturday and I got my braces tightened on Thursday. So then I will put on my sneakers, and these are the Nike Roshis, or Roches, however you pronounce it. Um, and they're white, so they're pretty dirty. <laughs> I try and wash them, but they're still pretty dirty. So then this is random, but I took a Motrin because I was in so much pain. If you have braces, you get the struggle. Then I went back downstairs and me and my mom walked to the gym. So in case you were wondering, I go to the gym pretty much every day because I'm not currently doing a sport. And if I don't go to the gym that day, I will go on a walk with my dogs. But usually I end up doing both. So... And I'm fortunate enough that the gym is really close to us. So on this particular gym day, I was doing bar class. And it was one of my favorite classes. I loved it so much. So when I came home, I was super tired. So I kind of just flopped onto my bed. And then my mom came in. And this was really funny. I don't really know what that was. So then I put my rubber bands in. And I literally hate these so much they hurt so bad they make my whole jaw just like hurt a lot so yeah i just ugh, hate them very much then i took my dogs for a walk
So then when I got home, I got to take my rubber bands out, which was a very glorious feeling because I was going to eat, and you don't wear them while you eat. And then I could finally move my jaw, and it felt really good. <laughs> then I took my sneakers off because I've been wearing them since 7 o'clock in the morning, so they were pretty sweaty and gross, so it felt good to take them off. Then I just chugged the rest of the water that was left from the gym. And in case you were wondering, we walked 1.45 miles, and this is just, like, the rest of the stats, I guess. And I love my Fitbit. I would definitely recommend getting a Fitbit if you like exercising. It's literally one of my favorite things ever. I'm obsessed with it. But yeah, by 11.47, I already had, had 8,400 steps. So then I texted my friends to ask if they could hang out, and nobody could. <laughs> And this is kind of just a little story time, I guess. Um, I kind of broke my blender, so we got this, like, temporary $20 one from Target. And this is the splatter on the ceiling from when I broke it. And this is my dog, who's really weird, and she always stares at random things. And she's also afraid of my tripod, which is pretty funny. <laughs> so then I made an acai bowl, and so I used the pure unsweetened packs and I just cut them open and then I run it under some warm water so that it's not like completely frozen especially since we are using a $20 blender and it really wasn't that powerful so yeah this is the acai bowl I made and I ate that <laughs> then I just kind of sat on the couch and scrolled through Twitter a little bit if you want to follow me on Twitter my username will be on the screen So then um, I saw this avocado pizza thing and it made me really want avocados, so I end up having those later. <laughs> so this, so now it was about 12.50 and I wanted to take a shower because I've been working out. So in the shower I used this Skin Cement Shaving Cream, this Victoria's Secret Body Wash, um, and then these Trader Joe's Shampoo and Conditioner. So after my shower, I opened the blinds back up because I had closed them before. And yeah, it was looking much sunnier than it was earlier this morning. Then I changed into my outfit for the day. My shirt is from Old Navy and then my jean shorts are from American Eagle. Then I got my computer from the other room and I grabbed my blanket off of my bed. And I just walked into my little office nook thing to get ready to work or whatever I do. I don't know. And I get cold really easily, so I like to have the blanket. So yeah, then I just edited some videos. The video I'm editing might be up by now. I'm not sure. If it is, I'll link it down below. And this was really random, but I have this like dream car chart that I made. And I saw it sitting there, so I decided to just hang it up. So yeah, this is just random. This is me looking for vlog music and then putting it in the video. Then I took a break from editing, so I watched Mel Joy's video because I saw she had just uploaded. And yeah, editing more. Then I got hungry around 2.30 and I went downstairs to make some avocado because I couldn't really eat anything else. You know, braces, fun. So I used this little avocado slicer thingy I had. And I just sliced that up into a bowl. And I added some mixed up salt. And then we ended up leaving to go pick my sister up. So I just put that avocado I just made in the refrigerator. So yeah, I just um, scrolled through Instagram, went through some random Instagram stories because they took like forever to come out of the place. So then we went to this little coffee shop um, that is in my town and I love this place. Their chai lattes are so good. So yeah, I got the chai latte and then a macaroon. So when we came home, I 
was hungry because that didn't really fill me up that much. So I got the avocado out of the refrigerator and then I watched Friends and edited a little bit more. And then it started to get stormy again like it was this morning. And the difference between the sky was so weird because it was like really blue one way and then like really gray the other way. So yeah, food again. This is turning into what I eat in a day. I'm really sorry. But with braces, a really good go-to dinner is soup. So I just had the soup and then I added some of these crackers because they get mushy in the soup so I can eat them and they taste good. Then I walked back upstairs to change into my pajamas and my pajamas are a sweatshirt and sweatpants. <laughs> And yeah, by this time it was storming a lot. I don't know why I'm showing the weather so much. I guess that was just a part of my day. And yeah, here's food again. I'm really sorry. So this was much later. This is like a really random thing that I made. I don't know. I added some milk to a bowl. And then I added a little bit of brown sugar. Some cinnamon. And then I mixed that up. And added a little bit of this agave syrup. Then I cut up an apple and poured the mixture I made onto the stove, then added the apples and kind of like boiled it so it made the apples really mushy and soft so I could eat them and they tasted really good. I didn't really eat the rest of the liquid part but I just ate the apples out of it. So then I just worked on my mom's website with her. If you ever need a wellness coach, um, you can check out her Facebook. I will put the link in the description. Then I just went back upstairs and picked up whatever was on my floor, so I put my shoes in my shoe bin. Then I put the On Guard on my feet. This is an essential oil in case you're wondering and it helps you prevent getting sick. So then I just did my skincare routine. Um, my skincare routine is pretty much the same as it is in my skincare routine video, except I use a different African black soap. I use this one, just a different brand. And then I also have been using the Mario Badescu Rose water spray, I do two spritzes, one on my forehead and then two on my cheeks every single night. Then I also use a different brand of the shea butter. Then I just fill my diffuser with some lavender oil, turn that on. And I will just set my alarm on my Fitbit for the next morning as far as planning to wake up to go to the gym. But then I will do my shrieks for the night and I honestly think streaks are like the stupidest thing ever but I don't know I do them anyways <laughs> and then I finally got into bed to read so yeah this is just me reading the book I'm currently reading is a Walt Disney biography so yeah when I was done reading put my book bark in put my book on the ground because I'm currently without a nightstand because I don't really have anywhere to put one um, and then I just drank the rest of my water bottle because I had filled it up earlier and had a drink in it all. Then I turned out my light and I don't usually sleep with the light on but you couldn't see me at all if I didn't. So yeah, that's just me going to sleep. So thank you guys so much for watching my day in my life summer edition video. If you enjoyed, make sure to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. And if you want to see any other videos, let me know in the comments down below. And I will see you guys in my next video.